Lakmagan Teak. The Lakmagan Teak disaster involved a driverless train. Nobody steering. Nobody in control. It had been parked around 11 p.m. that night in the village of Nantes to the northwest of Lac Magantique. Around one in the morning, sleep time for most, through a concatenation of errors, culminating in a soft, gradual letting go of the air brakes, this hulking, headlightless, dark, driverless train began slowly and inexorably rolling, rolling down a very gradual grade, 1.2% slope. Seven miles away and about 350 feet below lay the unsuspecting town. 18 minutes later, that driverless train was careening through Lac Magantique at over 60 miles per hour, sparks flying, metal screeching, completely out of control. When it derailed, with explosion after explosion, the balls of fire were three times higher than the highest of Lac Magantique's buildings. And as the oil coursed, tumbling along the ground, it poured into storm drains and burst out as huge fires further on from manholes and basements and even house chimneys. Human bodies were vaporized. Some people's remains never were found. Lac Magantique is a powerful metaphor, a lesson, for where we stand at this moment in historical time. Undeniably, though there's a whole party that denies it, this climate is changing. The Earth's climate is moving. It's beginning to accelerate toward a catastrophic and irreversible harm. But this is the point. It's not completely out of control. Not yet. We human beings still have time to catch it, to board it, to bring it under control. How? Step by step. We do it step by step. Whatever step is right for you, whether dramatic and public or unseen and private, one step will lead on to the other. You'll be shown it, and another, and another, until collectively, a collection of individual acts in freedom, a counter momentum, not towards death and disaster, but towards life and peace and hope, begins to take effect. Indeed, it has already begun, and we can all be part of it. We can all be part of it. That's the written part. <laughs>